Hello, hello, and welcome to Lighthouse Tarot, where we embrace the light within ourselves and within others. If you're new to my channel, warm welcome from my heart to yours. If you're an old subscriber, welcome back. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and comments. That really helps YouTube algorithm push my videos straight up to the top. Almost that fake 5K subscribers. Woo! I can't get my words to come out fast enough today. <laughs> the moon's in Leo, so I'm just full of energy. But today we're going to get into five signs that a Scorpio rising likes you. I did a poll and you said you wanted to see more Scorpio rising videos. So that's what we're going to do. So the first sign that a Scorpio rising likes you is that they will open up to you. And do not take this lightly because Scorpio is ruled by Pluto. And Pluto is the depths, the depths of our soul. It is everything taboo, everything swept under the rug and secrets. So Scorpio rising has a hard exterior. Think about a scorpion. It has a hard exterior, but it's soft underneath. So when a Scorpio rising likes you or is in love with you, they will open up to you. They will show the vulnerable side of them. They will talk to you about things that they don't talk to people with. For example, I really love my sister, and that is like one of the only people that I feel truly comfortable opening up to because she is also a Scorpio. We have this just really deep connection. The second sign that a Scorpio rising is in love with you is that they will share a secret with you. This is how you can tell they really love you because Scorpio risings will take their secrets to their grave. There are some things that Scorpio risings do not even tell their therapists. They don't even tell their family. There are certain secrets that they have kept since childhood. So if a Scorpio rising tells you a deep, dark secret, that's a sign that they're in love with you. <laughs> the third sign that a Scorpio rising is in love with you or falling in love with you is that they will become very protective of you. So even if the Scorpio rising is not in vicinity with you, if someone is talking crap about you, the Scorpio rising is going to be like, hey, quit it. I don't like that. Or this could happen if they are in close vicinity with you. Say you guys go out to a bar or a club and someone's being a little bit aggressive towards you. The Scorpio rising will get their body in between you and that person and say, fuck off. <laughs> go away. <laughs> and I found this true as a Scorpio rising woman. Uh, whenever people mess with my family or my partner, I do not allow that. And that's because Scorpio rising is ruled by Mars, which is a very masculine planet. It's our drive. It's our force in life. The Scorpio Risings are very protective of people, and that's a good sign that they're falling in love with you. If they're protective over you, and not in protective as just a physical sense, but protective over your emotional self. They might say, hey, this friend isn't so good for you. This friend keeps tearing you down, or I don't like how this family member treats you. That's because they're protective of your emotional health as well, because... Uh, Scorpio is a water sign. It's ruled by emotion. So they're very in tune to their emotions. Even though they might not seem to be, they are. The fourth sign that a Scorpio rising likes you is, man, I'm blinking out here. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, they will spend quality time with you. Much like Virgo and Aquarius, Scorpios really enjoy their alone time. They really enjoy their solitude. They enjoy just being alone and relaxing and because it can be an empathetic sign, it can, because it's water, it can pick up on a other, other people's emotions really quickly. So if you're upset or if you're going through something, they feel it. And sometimes they don't want to feel all that crap. They're like, no, that's enough. Lots of Scorpio Risings will stay in their room for the most part, or they will go to a park, or they will stay and work so they can be alone, you know? But once they start to spend quality time with you and they're going out of the way to pick you out of other people, that's a good sign that they're falling in love with you because they value their alone time. They value that time. That time is very precious to them, just like Aquarius, just like Virgo. They, they need their time alone to process their emotions, to process their thoughts, to process any transformation they're going through at a time. So if they spend quality time with you, that's a sure sign that they're falling in love with you. The fifth sign that a Scorpio rising is in love with you, this one's going to be obvious, but they will tell you that they love you. Now, if it is, if a Scorpio rising doesn't really want you to know, they might say in a friend way, like, you're my best friend and I love you. But they still say, I love you. And don't take that lightly when a Scorpio rising says that they love you because Scorpio rising is very paranoid of betrayal because that has tend to happen to them. You know, maybe in past relationships, maybe in childhood, they have been betrayed by people they trusted. 
So they tend to put their guard up when it comes to love. They do not say I love you very freely like a Cancer might or a Pisces might or someone just overly affectionate might just say casually, oh, I love you. I love you. Right, right when you're in the first week of dating. But if a Scorpio rising has known you for a long time and they say, I love you, or you guys get in a relationship and, you know, after six months they say, hey, I love you, they're in love with you. And I know that seems really straightforward and it's like, duh, but uh, you've got to be patient because it does take a while for Scorpio risings to feel. And that goes to the first way when they feel vulnerable and they open up with you. That's that's that means a lot to them and it should mean a lot to you. And you should never take that for advantage. And if you don't feel the same way, you need to just get out of here. But if you feel the same way, say it back to them so they feel that reassurance, so they feel that validation. So that was the five ways you can tell if the Scorpio rising is in love with you. As always, I'm open for birth chart readings and tarot readings. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!